Anyway, so if you want to see how I turn this into this, just keep on watching to the video in three, two, one. Damn, got it. back to its original form but it wasn't really straightened it was like unprofessionally straightened so like not straightened but sh you know what i'm saying and you're probably like girl why are you shooting your hair didn't you say you had heat damage in your last not last but one of your last few videos i was forced to do it to cut my ends even though you can cut your ends in the natural state i don't know why <sighs> Anyways, I'll just show you my little setup. I got my brush to brush my hair. I got my got to be spray. I got my little rubber bands. Not rubber bands, but like for the ponytail, the ponytail holders. I got a comb to detangle. And I got some extra gel. This is not really actual gel. I didn't want like wet gel because my hair is straightened so why would I put actual gel so I just got braiding gel that is thick that is hard but not hot you know what I'm trying to say and yeah I guess I'll just start the video this isn't a tutorial this is my first time ever trying to do this but I don't know but let's at first let's take out this wrap I try to wrap it like how people wrap their hair when they straighten it to go to sleep and i left it in this for like a good four days um if you see me looking up it's because there's a big mirror i'll probably show you the mirror i don't know how i'm going to like set up this camera but yeah okay let's do this out <coughs> Just so you know, if you see me breaking my bones, I mean dancing, just know that I'm listening to music. Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully this doesn't turn into... Okay, I got my three parts. I don't know if you guys can see. Hopefully this is good enough, because it's hot. Let's detangle. Ow. I'm gonna try and use some of this, because... Don't take this much, because... Um, what do I do now? Just hold it? I don't know. No. Look at my ends. What are you coming in and in wrong? Just get ready for work, 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 work. Let me stop. Let me out. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Last piece out. So 
it all can be in one. Would that even work? All in one, like, I don't know. It's one of these needs? Most likely not, but oh well. Okay, I'm gonna just use a elastic band because I don't know why.
it's not sticking down. Iron don't like this. What in the world? Okay, does it look more thick? I don't know about thick. I don't know about that. Stay down. Please stay down. It's not that hard. Oh, I'm messing this up. Yeah, I messed it up. I'll just come back when I finish at least the middle. <laughs> what in the world? Oh my gosh. But anyways, guys, I tried, I tried. This is like, what, I'm not even kidding, 45 minutes later, 46, I don't know. I tried to do, like, the big squiggly ones, the pretty ones, like that one. But these hands and this hair said no. So, I'm going to just go with this. And hopefully it looks way better with the little rhinestones that I'm going to put. So, yeah. I'm going to do more edges on here, like, try and actually do squiggly ones. But I guess I'll just see you tomorrow. I'll just wrap it up and go to sleep and do what I got to do. Okay, see you tomorrow. So, it's tomorrow. It was such a stress waking up. I mean, carrying on this hairstyle. And you might be like, it's for my photo shoot. Like I recently just told you in the recent clips, I'm basically doing like a tin foil photo shoot. I'm gonna put like a clip or like my inspiration basically. And yeah, and I'm just using regular old tin foil. And I was very cheap with it. I used tiny squares. But what was I saying? Oh yeah, it was such a struggle trying to carry this out because I had to go outside and I sweated it out. Here's how bad it was. My edges were gone. This part was uplifted and then I had to re-put the products and whatever. This took like a good two hours. I don't, I don't do the math, two hours. Oh my gosh, it's the photo shoot for me. I don't like this for a second. But anyways, you're like, what's going on with your edges and stuff? And then I was like, ugh, maybe the gems will make it look better. Mm, kind of. But anyways, I've been using these gems. I got them from Walmart, right? And then they came with all of these packs, but all I wanted was like the clear ones. But no, I had to get all of these. But they're adhesive, so that means they're like sticker gems, so they can just stick on. So basically, right now, I'm just trying to do like this little... I don't know what it's called eyeliner look and i was like why not do it on camera i don't know how i'm going to do this i think i need an actual mirror guys i'll be back and when i'm back you just probably see me doing these pictures okay so bye okay well i added more um what is it called tin foil finished the look took me like a good 20 minutes not bad not bad I'm gonna move these around and stuff and put one on my lip later. And I guess I'll just switch the part of the pictures. Okay, bye bye. This whole process was so stressful. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Here's how awkward it was. <laughs> and I even used my LED lights for like effects. You're gonna see the results with 3D photo. <laughs> obviously did another look for some of the pictures it came out hopefully nice but anyways thank you so much for watching or staying to the end of this video to see me say this or hear me say this um don't forget to do this this and that and that da, da, da. right and i guess i'll just see you in the next video hmm. bye okay bye